What a way to begin sled hockey at the 2022 Paralympic Winter Games in Beijing. We welcome you inside National Indoor Stadium. Quite a showdown, whether it's preliminaries or the gold medal match. It is Team Canada versus Team USA, a battle of one versus two in a rematch of the 2018 gold medal game won by the United States in Pyeongchang. Declan Farmer and Greg Westlake took the faceoff for their respective teams. Just about 40 seconds left on the man advantage for the United States. Roybal with a beautiful pass to Farmer who speeds his way into the zone. Farmer pass to Pole shot, score! Unbelievable play by Declan Farmer there. The patience that he showed with the puck, waited for the defenseman to commit and slid it right over to Josh Pauls for the early goal. Fantastic transition work by the United States. They brought that puck all the way from their D zone. You can see how patient Declan is here with the puck. Doesn't force it, waits to get past the defender. Then a one-timer by Josh Pauls to put the Americans up 1-0 on the power play. Liam Hickey on the puck for Team Canada. It squirts out to Farber, pass just wide in the slot, but backed up by Roybal. His shot and a score. Wow, what a shot by Brody Roybal from near the blue line. Canada thought they had the puck out of the zone. Brody comes flying in to keep it in and just lets it rip. And so the United States does get that late first period goal to go up 2-0. Another great pass by Declan Farmer. Just missed Jack Wallace, but there's Brody to pick it up. Looks like it deflected off of Dixon just went right over LaRock's glove. Been really impressed with Malik so far. As a youngster, it can be a little intimidating to play in these big games against the Canadians at your first Paralympic Games, but he's been physical, he's been confident, uh, and, and really, uh, really performing well for his first Paralympic game. United States four checks, it's Wallace, pass in front, a shot and a score! Right on cue, Malik Jones with the tip right in front. Gets up over LaRock. That puck was clearly tipped at least once, Taylor. Maybe even by LaRock himself. Let's take a look. Wow, unbelievable deflection in front by Malik. Wallace puts it right on his stick. Malik with the perfect angle of his blade. You can see him lay it down just slightly. Here's Declan Farmer who swoops in, looking for a teammate in front. High in the slot, it's Pauls with Zich also in the mix. Mashevich pokes it in. Score for the United States. Mashevitz has been lurking there all game long. We've talked about it time after time, hanging around the crease. And that's exactly why he hangs out there. Puck dribbles across the crease. He dives, pokes it in. Farmer with the shot, the rebound off LaRock, and it's tipped in by Josh Mashevitz, the 33-year-old from LaGrange, Illinois. One of the five Purple Heart recipients on Team USA, US Marine Lance Corporal, Josh Mashevitz with his first goal of the Paralympics. Here's Jack Wallace in the corner of his own zone for the United States. It squirts past Dixon, and that allows the Americans to clear Mashevitz up to Kevin McKee. There's Declan Farmer in the middle. Farmer with the score! Unbelievable play by Kevin McKee with the saucer pass over to Declan with the finish, his fourth point of the night. And he was missing the goal, Taylor. He had three assists and now a goal for Declan Farmer. Unbelievable play here. You see the touch up the ice to Kevin. He just sauces it right over the, the Canadian stick and Declan puts it right under King's Mill. I don't think he quite went five pole on King's Mill either. I think he wrapped it around the far side of King's Mill. Impressive either way. 5-0 Team USA knocks off Canada. What a debut for the Americans against the Canadians. They improve to 1-0 in group play and take on South Korea in their next game of the Beijing Paralympics from National Indoor Stadium.